Yo, 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 what is up, guys? Fur here, and today we're gonna be talking about Big Mom and Kaido. And now, uh, this is specifically on the events that happened in chapter 930 when Big Mom showed up to Wano, and that's when we had the moment of Kaido being in some form of distress because he did not want Big Mom to get into Wano. And because of this, a lot of people in the community are saying that Kaido was afraid of Big Mom or that he was shook because of the way he acted. And I personally think that's just flat out wrong, and I think most of it stems from what Kaido said before. Now this was when he was on Denden Mushi with Big Mom and he told Big Mom that he was gonna kill her if she showed up to Wano and when she actually showed up it was a problem because Kaido was hell bent on not letting Big Mom into Wano even though he said he was gonna kill her if she showed up and this is why a lot of people are saying that why didn't Kaido keep that same energy was he really afraid of Big Mom or is there another reason behind that now regarding the whole situation of Kaido getting worried of Big Mom making it into Wano I think his reaction is justified in so many ways while Kaido did show that he was worried about Big Mom potentially making it into Wano, I don't think it was a power level issue or that Kaido was really afraid of Big Mom. I think everyone is of the mindset that the Yonko should be pretty relative in terms of power level. So that wasn't the issue here. It was more so of Big Mom bringing problems to not only Kaido, but also to the people of Wano. Given that Kaido is allied with the Shogun, Big Mom making her way into Wano could potentially ruin the relationship that Kaido has with the Shogun. You saw that Kaido actually cares about the rules of Wano, so to keep things how they are, he has to avoid these things. Now, there's two key points I want to talk about as to why Kaido's reaction made sense. Now, the first one is that Kaido wasn't there himself. He was on a different island with, you know, Onigashima, you know, telling his underlings to get rid of Big Mom. And as we saw, it wasn't exactly easy because Big Mom came along with her entire fleet of commanders. So that was a problem already in of itself. It's one thing if Big Mom is coming but it's a whole different question if she's bringing her entire squadron with her. And as Kaido stated in that chapter, that would eventually escalate to a full-on Yonko crew battle, which brings problems for Kaido, but it also brings problems for the people of Wano because they shouldn't be dealing with the businesses of other Yonkos, right? And more than likely, Wano would get devastated from a battle between two Yonkos. That's just obvious. So Kaido's reaction was justified in that sense. And we also have to realize that it would have taken some time before Kaido had gone to face Big Mom. And at that point in time, Big Mom and her crew would have definitely done major damage before Kaido shows up to interject Big Mom. Now, the second biggest thing is Big Mom's Deverford ability, which I think is the most versatile ability in the entirety of One Piece. Apart from her having her crew with her, Big Mom is like a one one man army in a sense a sort of overpowered version of capone you might say once big mom lands on wano by using her social powers she's going to have the ability to take over certain parts of the island by making homies tree homies animal homies the list just goes on the environment essentially becomes her weapon and with that she can do a lot of damage very fast and no one's going to be able to stop her unless kaido himself shows up Added on to the fact that these homies are basically like zombies that can't really die unless you actually affect the soul itself. I don't think Kaido's crew has anyone with soul related powers like Brook. So Prometheus would be going ham. And Big Mom doesn't have much to lose anyways because this isn't her territory. She came here for Luffy and Kaido has much more to lose. And that's why he was a little agitated when he found out that Big Mom was really close into making it into Wano. So I feel like Kaido's reaction was justified. But eventually something huge is going to happen between Big Mom and Kaido because Big Mom is already on the island. So that's going to be a moment where I want to see what's going to happen next when these two interact. And I think we might be getting little flashbacks here and, here and there or information about the Rocks Pirates and how these two Yonkos are affiliated with the Rocks. But anyways, what do you guys think about this? Do you think Kaido's reaction was justified? Comment down below what you guys think. Like the video if you liked it. And subscribe for more One Piece content on this channel. And before I end this video, I'm sure a lot of you have noticed that I was MIA for a good amount of time. And this is because of copyright. I actually had three copyright strikes on my channel at one point but again all the strikes are gone and we should be back to the regular schedule and i should be putting out content a lot more frequently now so that's the news if you guys were wondering as to where i was there you go but yeah that's pretty much it for this video it is pharaoh and i will see you guys later peace